Welcome back. In the last video, we talked about what makes a, an image plasma cut appropriate. We talked about positive and negative space and trying to think about what parts of the image you want to turn into metal and what parts you want to cut out. We also talked about some of the problems that occur. So in that video, we looked at this image at the end of the video and uh, we noticed that this letter, the center of the letter O is if, if this black part is going to be positive space or if it's going to be metal, that is, then when we pick up our project off the machine, this black part is going to get left behind and we won't have a letter O, we'll just have a big hole in a bird. So I'm going to show you how to doctor this image up so that it is plasma cut appropriate. Uh, the first um, piece of software that I'm going to use is available on all of our school computers, in the Linux computers. And so um, that's the software I'm going to use. We can also use, uh, that software is called MyPaint. And it's free to download it's, and it's available on our school computers. But um, we can also use MS Paint. And the problem with MS Paint, although it's a good program, MS Paint is only available on the Windows computer. So let's start this uh, tutorial by downloading this image. So we're going to right click and we're going to save image as. And I'm going to name it. And, you know, I'd like you to put your first name. And then I'd like you to put your last name and then what it is. So in this case, lovebirds. Okay, first name, last name, lovebirds. You know, if your first name is John, there it is. And your last name is Doe. John Doe lovebirds. That's the kind of thing I want so that I can tell whose file it is. So let's save that. And if you look up here, it's telling us it's going to save it to the desktop. That's fine. Good. Now this icon here flashes and notice right now we're in Firefox. I would like my students to use Firefox. Do not use other browsers like uh, Chrome or Internet Explorer or Internet Edge because um, then you're going to have, you're not going to be able to do exactly what I'm doing in this tutorial. So use Firefox. I downloaded the image. This shows me that something freshly downloaded. If I click on it, I can see the image and I can also click on open containing folder and that will take me to where it is stored. It is stored in desktop and there's the actual file. Okay, So if you can't find your file, sometimes it's in a different folder, then that's how you go here and you choose the containing folder and you can locate where on the computer it lives right there. All right, so let's just minimize this here and um, let's open up my paint which is the one that is free and available on our Linux computers. Just pull this window to the side and let's grab Lovebirds. There it is. And dump it on here. There's our image. Now, I want to color this in. And when you start working with my paint, your settings might be different than mine. So I'm just going to show you quickly how to get the right settings. Uh, first thing we need to know is it's not always appropriate to erase. Using the eraser doesn't just erase the black, but it's erasing the white as well. So if you ever want to touch up an image in my paint using an eraser erases all the way through right to the background okay so there's your background and this is erasing right through making it transparent so we don't want to use the eraser just going to undo that what we want to do is use black and white uh, paint essentially so i'm going to choose a tool i'm going to choose the paintbrush and when you choose the paintbrush the paintbrush might not be the right size okay so you can go into brush and you can change, increase or decrease the brush size. Um, if you look at the shortcut, there's an F and a D. So F is a bigger brush, D is a smaller brush. So if we take a look at the effect of that, if I hold F and keep tapping it, hold on a sec here, no, it's not working. Let's try that again. Hmm, there you go, F and D to make the brush size bigger and smaller, okay? All right, so also when you start my paint for the first time, it's gonna have a specific type of brush chosen. So there's brush types, change brush. There's all these different brushes and I think pencil is the default brush. So if you come along here and you try to draw in some tabs to keep this, oh, it's in like a pencil, it's not dark enough. It's frustrating. So my suggestion is for you to change brushes and change to a felt marker. This one says marker fat. That's what you want to use because if you take a look at what happens when you use marker fat, you get a nice solid line. Okay. 
So that's a tab that's going to connect it like a stencil. And I think I'll do one at the top as well. And I'm being a little harsh about it, just kind of quickly smudging that in. And there we go. We've doctored it up so that middle piece is now connected. There are other tools you can learn about. So if you want to draw straighter lines or circles or other types of lines, you can explore what options there are here. But I'm just doing a quick doctoring of my image with the smudging. Um, now, if you needed to erase, then you would use the color picker tool. Click on that and you would take a drop of white. And now when you go back to the brush, you're actually drawing with white. Okay, it's a really quick and easy way to choose the right color for what you want to do. Is just again take the palette color picker, take a drop of black, use the brush, and you're now using black. Okay, so color picker, paint brushes, changing your brush size, changing your brush to a felt marker instead of a pencil. Those are the things we're doing. Now that that's complete, I'm going to save it. So you can go file and you can just hit save and it's going to save right over top of the original and if I was to leave here now we look at our original file here and there it is it's been changed permanently it's now plasma cut appropriate so that's it for this video showing you how to use my paint to doctor up an image to make it so that it's plasma cut appropriate